Hey y'all, welcome back. I'm Kess. I'm getting ready to change out of this bag, so before I do, I wanted to share it with you. Hope you're all having a good day. And so I'm going to get right on into it. So this is a clear tote that I got from Amazon. I think it was about $10. I can link it below. Um, they had all sorts of different colors, but you know I had to choose purple. And I'm enjoying it because you can change out the pouches and have a totally different look. But for right now, I wanted to do something for Halloween. So I'll show you what it looks like from the outside. First, I'll tell you that I have this little spider pocket back holder with ghoul friend in it that I got from Bath and Body Works. And I have this little lip gloss bag charm over here that I got from Claire's with the little purple bat. So this is what it looks like from the side. If you don't totally stuff it, it can be a little floppy, but I'm okay with it. And there's a pocket back here. So this is what it looks like from the back side. And from this side. So as you can see, it's important to keep your stuff neat and organized when you have a clear tote like this. And to have everything matching helps too. Okay. So, this is what it looks like from the top. I'll go with this. Oh, I meant to put these in here. Yes. Got to have my treats. So, yeah. I just got... This is a pouch from Amazon. And I just have my Halloween treats just like it says. I have this little container that I kept so I could refill it with more caramel M&M's. And for those times that I need to be good, I've got my Keto Chocolate Squares. I've got some Skittles from the movies or... Oh, I think that was from a football game that my daughter didn't finish. So that belongs in there too. And I have my makeup pouch from Dollar Tree. I think it looks pretty being clear where you can see through it too. These little zippers get hid. I need a zipper pull on here. They get hid up in the little cracks and crevices of these Dollar Tree pouches. So in here, I have my mirror from the Dollar Tree. Some Neutrogena individually wrapped makeup remover wipes. I have a tinted lip oil. As you can see, it's a nude color. And I have my lip oil that's pumpkin spice from Thrive Cosmetics. I have one of my scent box perfumes. Which one is this? This is Bon Bon? Yeah. I like these for a purse. They're very handy. Here's another one. I like this one the best. This is my favorite um, atomizer so far. So this is Good Girl from Carolina Herrera. And some creamy eyeshadow from Revlon, I think. And I have a purple eyeliner from NYX. This is the stuff that I always carry. Urban Decay um, eyeshadow stick. I think it's, it's in a nasty color name like mold or something like that. They have weird names. Better Than Sex um, from Too Faced Mascara. And the uh, um, ColourPop Cosmetics collab with Hocus Pocus. From last year this is a super dark purple liquid lipstick packaging is really cute mm. nail tabs scrunchy the perfume I always carry angel from Moogler and this is what I wore Sunday uh, um, gold lip gloss and my 
candy corn lip gloss from Bath and Body Works. That's about it for that pouch. Next, I have a notebook from the Dollar Tree. I just thought this was pretty since it shows the purple. And I have a grab and go pouch. Uh, that way, if I don't want to carry my bag in, I can leave it in the car. So, this little one right here, they came together. But this one has medicines and stuff like that in there. You know, the usual band aids, liquid skin. Uh, etc. and shout wipes. You get the idea. Same thing as always. And then so inside it has some card slots. And so I have wait it has lots of slots in here actually. I have cards in there. I have wet ones, Kleenex, breath strips, I think I need to put some more flossers in here for times that I need those. I have my nail file in the plastic case from Dollar Tree. <clears throat> I have a mask in here. And then on the other side, there's a big slot. No, that was the big slot pocket behind the card slots. I've just got it stuffed full. Anyway, you get the idea. All the stuff that you need to carry inside somewhere. And I also have a little pocket knife here. So if I just wanted to leave the house with this, I still have a way to get into a container or package or something if I ever need to. Sometimes we get really hungry when we're out and sometimes things are hard to open. So it's always good to have something like that. So there's that and my favorite lotion or body cream right now wicked vanilla woods from Bath and Body Works this is comparable to bonfire bash except bonfire bash is smokier and this one has pink pepper instead but very similar this is a bathroom pouch got this from Amazon also so in here I have what you would expect I have Oh, this needs to go in with my makeup. Actually, oil blotting sheets. My skin's dry, but around my nose, I'm oily. Um, Kleenex, that's empty. I need to throw that away. Looks like I need to clean out my bag. More wet ones, stuff that you would need in the bathroom. Here's a pad and a liner or two and a tampon, deodorant. shout wipe the usual, usual stuff you need in the bathroom I reused this for a pill case just had some little um, silicone hair twisters in it and my keys with the Victoria's Secret wristlet on here. These things are huge. No trouble finding your keys with those. And that's about it for the for the inside, except my earbuds. So then in this pocket back here, I'll just turn it around and show you. I have some Kleenex so I can get to those easily. I have a... Uh, Enchanted candy potion pocket back so I can get to that easily too. I have some pins. There's just some earrings that my cousin made that I got tired of wearing the other day, so I took them off. There's some lip balm. And a couple of bracelets. So all this kind of looks pretty in the clear bag to me. And then last thing over here, I have this cute little necklace that I got from Amazon. 
So there she is. She's cute. All right. Well, I'm not going to try to set this up because I've got all the weight on the straps right now. So I don't think I could very well. So anyway, thanks for watching. Hope you're all having a good week. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, let me know. And I will see you next time. Bye.